Good evening. Today I'll talk about heteroscedasticity test in our studio with the help of Briss Pagan test. I'll discuss about Briss Pagan test with the help of three various steps. Step first talks about installing and loading LM test package in library. Step second talks about a suitable regression model and storing its value. And third step talks about BP test and then suitable model which is command for Briss Pagan test in our studio. So let's start. I have already installed LM test package in my R studio. So simply I load it with the help of library, library and then LM test. It means LM test package is loaded in library of R studio. I have data set of unemployment rate and inflation from 1950 to 2014. I'm going to run a suitable regression model. Unemployment rate is dependent variable and inflation is independent variable. It means First and foremost, I have to talk about step number two by running a suitable regression model and storing its value in order to apply heteroscedasticity test in our studio. So simply, uh, I'm writing here model one equal to LM and then unemployment rate tilde inflation. It means a regression model will be stored in model one with the help of this command. After writing this, simply I press on enter. So here model one has been created. Let's talk about step number third, which is BP test. It means Briss Pagan test and then model one. So this is the command for Briss Pagan test. Then enter. Well, if I talk about null hypothesis, null hypothesis is there is constant variance or homoscedasticity in residual. If I talk about p-value, p-value is greater than 0 0.05. It means 0 0.8787 is greater than 0 0.05 hence null hypothesis is accepted it means we can say that there is constant variance or homoscedasticity but it means there is no heteroscedasticity in this residual of the regression model that is all about Briss Pagan test in our studio. Thank you very much.